I'm Ethan Hamilton, I'm 18 years old, from North Allerton, local to Croft. Um, yeah, racing the Clio Cup this year. Um, probably Jason Plato. Ever since I used to come to touring cars when I was younger, I'd always support like Plato, Matt Neal, just like the big names that are still in it today, really. Uh, my first experience was driving a Citroen Saxo. Um, after after I got heavy for karting, we uh, we bought a Citroen Saxo and started driving that in my dad's yard. Um, we did a bit of testing and we were pretty quick and we rocked up at the first round and qualified third out of 26. So to be honest, I had no expectations and we went in and yeah, it went pretty well to be fair. Better than we thought, I think. What's going to happen at the first corner and how am I going to position the car and just it's a whole new experience it's completely different to karting and anything like that because it's obviously proper cars so yeah I think just knowing what to expect really. Yeah they're, uh, they're a good little car I think they're great to learn in because they have such a like technique to drive um, and I think that learning racecraft and everything else that you need to know moving forward you can learn in the Junior Saloon Car Championship. Uh, last round at Silverstone we were in the lead and I got knocked off on the last corner last lap and I actually finished second so but that was probably still a highlight. Well they're two completely different cars and I think like one's left hand drive, one's right hand drive and you've just I think you've got to get on get on with it and put it to the back of your mind that you're actually racing two different cars. It ended up at Brands Hatch where we were driving two cars twenty minutes in between sessions, so it was pretty flat out. Oh, massively important. It literally like we were struggling to get a budget to even start or think about doing Cleo Cup. Um, and it was a massive help from obviously Tony winning the scholarship to, to be racing in the VW Cup and then that leading to touring cars which was absolutely mega at the back end of last year. So we turned up here actually at Croft and we did a fitness test, a media test and then we did some laps on track with a passenger who was assessing us on, on paper and then they got it down to I think final 10 and that went to Snetterton where the winner was decided but it was just on driving at Snetterton. Uh, I think just learning slicks really because I'd never done anything on slicks prior to doing that and it was just completely different driving something with so much grip. Oh it was unbelievable. Like. It was just pretty surreal to be honest. I never thought at 17 I would even be thinking about driving a British touring car. So to, to do it was just unbelievable. I think just learning like who you're actually racing with, you've just got to think, well it's just another name. Because you're racing against such big names and I'm just a 17 year old lad from North Hallett racing against Jason Plato and people like that, um, but you've just got to put it to the back of your mind and get on with it, I think. Uh, probably race two at Silverstone, where we are in the mix, we had a top 20 finish, that was probably the highlight of the weekend. Yeah, the season started alright, qualifying has been pretty strong so far, uh, we had a third and a fourth, a bit disappointing this morning at Croft, we are eighth. Um, but hopefully can build on that in the races and we've had we've nearly nearly been on the podium a couple of times so I wanna I wanna try and build on that as the season goes on and hopefully get get ourselves on the podium. I think next year touring cars is where I wanna be um, but that's just down to, to sponsors. Um, but if not touring cars I think minis is probably the option to go been on the talk package and I think it'll put us in good stead to hopefully try and push for touring cars a year after.
British touring cars at 17, that's definitely my highlight. I think just get into it anywhere you can, any car, get out on the track, get you noticed and get in touch with sponsors and just try and build on, get some results and build on that really.